Caught this hawk stopping in the middle of the road handheld through the moon roof. I'll admit I have only had the lens a short time, and I am still getting to know it. But it is a wonderful lens. Well balanced it crunches down to a size small enough to fit in a case meant for a 8200mm f2.8. The lens focuses very fast, silently, and has very cream broker, out of focus backgrounds. The photo attached was taken with a K3 in poor lighting at f5.6 ISO 1600, and cropped. Hopefully you get an idea of its potential. It isn't cheap, but quality lenses rarely are. I sold a Sigma 15500 and can tell you there is a world of improvement with this lens, especially on the long end. It works both on cropped and full frame bodies although I have only the former. Very good picture quality. A bit heavy, but I expected it to be. I've been watching this lens since it came out and finally got it. Ro, I'm giddy to write this review since having the lens for only one hour. I'm an amateur hobby photographer, shooting on K1 for almost 3 years. I took this lens out in my yard as soon as it arrived and shot the unedited pic attached. The reach is incredible and autofocus super fast. After an hour my arms started to tire, and I'm lean and strong. Now, I'm off to read the instructions. If you've had this lens on your Amazon list, get it. You may write a review this fast too it is a heavy lens but well worth the sharp images capture. After using it for a month, it's become a treasured item. One of my better decisions reviewers mentions of the weight made me concerned, but after handling it in many different situations, I've concluded that the weight can be readily managed. The payoff in images makes it worth the added care it's definitely a big chunk, but it delivers exceptional light gathering power, resolution to spare and delicious bokeh I've also concluded that the reviewer who said, just buy it had the right idea.